We're doing two things today. I'm showing you how to make healthy food in the form of cashew chicken. I know it can seem really tough to make your own food every day to be healthy and eat properly. What really helps is what this whole phenomenon that you've seen online called preppers. They'll make dishes for every single meal of the day, seven days ahead sometimes. Most of the time, these guys are very successful because they're basically eating the same thing three times a day, meaning your body gets really used to kind of processing those ingredients, but making sure also that those ingredients, you use a Tupperware like this to basically give you portion control. And then you'll have a third of it will be complex carbs, let's say red rice that we're using today. A third of it will be protein and some fats. So today we're using some chicken and some cashews. And the other third of it will just be a lot of kind of vegetables. So that's what I'm gonna show you how to do today. We're gonna to start off by cooking down the broccoli. So I've got a whole head of broccoli here. Cut that up, just kind of separate all those florets. A little bit of olive oil goes into my wok. Broccoli goes right in. One white onion. One clove of garlic. And then most of the flavor here will come from a little bit of sesame oil and just a tad bit of salt. You just want to stir fry that until it's slightly cooked. I'm going to add in a little bit of rice wine, just to steam it a little bit. Next, I'm going to grab about 150 grams of chicken breasts and 150 grams of chicken thighs. The chicken thighs give more fat and more flavor to the whole dish. Chicken breast is basically very low fat but high in protein. You want to chop those up, keep that right here to the side. Get my other pan nice and hot. A little bit of oil. Garlic is so great just because it brings so much flavor to any dish you put it in. I'm going to fry off the garlic just a tad bit. I've got some cashews over here which are really kind of high in good fats. Roughly chop all that. That gets thrown in with the garlic. Add in our chicken. A little bit of rice wine. Tiny bit of soy sauce just for some flavor. Some red chili flakes. And then I'm going to add the juice of one lemon. Our onions are nice and brown, our broccoli is bright green, our chicken is properly coated with the sauce. Pretty much good to go. I'm just going to season the chicken with literally a drop of sesame oil just to bring those flavors out. So it's really important always to have a really balanced meal. People usually stay away from carbs simply because they're so scared of eating it because there's such bad press around carbs. But carbs are really an essential part of everyday eating. I put in my chicken. As I said, this has a great source of protein, but with the cashews, it also has a great source of fat. Fat is another one of those ingredients that people shy away from, but it's also extremely essential to an everyday diet. So by making food by yourself at home, at least you are in total control when you're done putting it in Tupperware, all you have to do is wait for the steam to kind of come out, place your lids, take it to work with you, do that times seven, and that's your weekly diet plan.